Assalamualaikum and hi everyone. My name is Muhammad Shafiqul Zaman bin Abdul Majid, one of the senior language teachers at Center for Modern Languages, University Malaysia Pahang. Welcome. For your information, I will be part of the teaching team for the courses that you are taking this semester at Center for Modern Languages. So, for further information, you can refer to the details that I have put in the slides whereby I have included my contact number and also my email address. See you in the class. Are you majoring in technical, technology or engineering studies? If yes, then this course suits you the best. Welcome to UHL 2452 English for Vocational Purposes. In this course, you are going to learn about English for specific purposes in the context of technology, technical, and engineering. Some of the elements that you are going to learn will be about technical description, process explanation, and also on job application process. Why job application process? By the end of this course, it is hoped that you can apply the knowledge that you have gained and use it when you're going to apply for a job or employment. If you want to know more about this course, join us. Bye. For UHL 2452 or English for Vocational Purposes, this will be the course learning outcome. By the end of the lesson, students should be able to, number one, determine salient information from different processes and procedures sources. Number two, analyze salient information from technical written materials and documents. Number three, demonstrate presentation skills using appropriate content, accurate language, and effective delivery strategies in describing products. And number four, express ideas effectively using appropriate language in resumes and a mock job interview. For the course synopsis, this course is designed to provide technical students with skills and knowledge for workplace. It provides opportunities for students to learn and employ language skills and strategies appropriate to written and spoken discourse for specific audiences. The contents of this course consists of technical processes and procedures, technical descriptions and job interview process. Students are required to listen to, evaluate, organize and write technical information and prepare for a mock job interview. The learning activities include carrying out presentation, collaborative learning, active engaged learning, and online learning. This course is defined within the SAFA B2 to low C1 level. SAFA here refers to Common European Framework of Reference. For the course syllabus, this course is divided into three main parts. Number one, technical oral presentation. Number two, process and procedure. And the last part will be job application process. For this course, it will take 14 weeks for you to complete it. And for the 14 weeks, it is further divided into three stages. Stage number one will be about technical oral presentation. And it takes six weeks for you to complete it. Stage two would be process and procedure for three weeks. And the final stage or the stage three will be on job application process and it will be for five weeks. Well, I have explained everything that you need to know regarding the basic structure of the course that you're going to take. What are you waiting for? Join me and the rest of your friends in the class. See you.